Yeah, I know. You're ready to go out. Your makeup is on flick. Outfit on flick. Everything is on flick. I know I'm saying flick too much. But guess what? Your edges or your invisible edges are not on flick. But today, I'm going to show you guys how I get this shit snatched. First, you need a comb. And then you need a toothbrush. Yeah, I know. Ghetto, but it's okay. You need that. And of course, you got to be glue. Ultra glue. Girl, this shit right here. It's going to make your thing look bomb. You're going to take that comb and you're just going to comb and detangle your edges or your hair. Because me, I don't have edges. So whatever you got in the front of your head, comb it. Make sure it's like detangled. Then you grab your got to be glue. Just use a tiny little bit on your toothbrush. Like the smallest amount. You see? The smallest amount, guys. The smallest. And then just apply that to your hair. First, I usually just apply a little bit and then, like, use it as a gel first. Like, massage it to my hair, on my hair. Massage it a little bit, like, make sure it's, like, you know, soft and stuff. Make sure your hair is not too dry so that it can lay, you know, nicely. So, I use that comb and I just, like, apply that to my edges. I'm faking, like, baby hairs because I really don't have baby hairs, even though sometimes I think I have baby hairs. But, yeah, I don't have baby hairs. I fake my baby hairs. So, I usually use my finger and just, like, press it down. I don't use too much, but sometimes when I use too much, I go back in with, like, a paper towel or something and just wipe it out. Because the more you put, the more cakey it's going to look. Like, this stuff, you just need the smallest amount, like, for real. If you use too much, it's just going to look like cement on your head like it's just gonna look extra dry and extra just too much just use a little bit okay a little bit goes a long way because i know y'all and i know girls we like to just use too much products and then always complain about why things are running out the whole time you just need a little bit mm -hmm. as you can see right now i'm using my paper towel to just clean up my edges. I recommend doing this before you wear makeup because you don't want your hair to have makeup on it because when you use a toothbrush and like put it, you know, in your hair, it's just gonna, you know, put makeup on your hair. So do this before you put on makeup. Yeah. These braids are like two or three weeks old. I know, gross, but I'm gonna wash my hair today. Like as I'm recording this voiceover, I'm gonna wash my hair today. But I'm gonna slick the other side down. So yeah. Watch and learn. <laughs> Because I don't have edges and, you know, as you can see, I'm kind of bald in the front right there. I'm going to use like a black eyeshadow from my Murphy palette. And I'm just going to, why am I talking like that? What's wrong with me? Anyways, let me go back to my Maryland accent or my African accent. I'm going to use a black eyeshadow and I'm just going to put that on the bald spots of my hair or my baby hair side or my fake baby hair, whatever you want to call it. And I'm just going to put that right there so that... It looks like I have hair. Whole time I'm really bald. Like my family is literally bald. My mom is bald. My dad is bald. My sister about to be bald. And I'm probably about to be bald too. So yeah. And I use my beauty blender to just like blend out everything. Just so it looks like my real hair. Even though I don't have hair. Then of course I'm going to snatch my wig on. Mm -hmm, because I'm a wig wearer. Wearer? What? Is that even a word? But all I do is wear wigs. I don't like sew-ins. So, yeah, I'm going to snatch my wig on, comb that 
so it looks nice and then I'm done yeah that's really how you slick your edges on the your weave for just three dollars and that got to be gel it's literally three bucks like three bucks guys you can't beat it I hope you guys enjoyed this video I love you guys so much and I will see you guys in my next video